back to the second. And this is Michael Block at the difficult par four. This for birdie. And that was beautifully done. Up ahead at the 13th. Pretty soon we're going to be talking with Michael Block, one of our PGA Club professionals from Arroyo Tribuco in Mission Viejo. Really talented player. What a shot there. That's a good shot. That's a good spot to putt from. All right, let's see if Michael Block can make this birdie putt. He did. Nicely done. Get a look at this action, David. Having a tremendous day. This looks good. Thank you. Thanks. Who are kind of stewards of the game in a way. They're responsible for their membership, the juniors. To, to appreciate that and understand what it is, he, he talked about coming up short because knowing that over the green is dead. Well, I'm dead now because I just booked all the action on him. He, up and down. And he starts it with a birdie. Block for three in a row. Turn. Up and Turn. down. Good putt. Back over 15, our buddy Michael Block. 63 down the hill just a little bit. Right on. Pretty good line. Oh, yeah. One of the better shots Thank we've you. seen today. Haven't seen too many better, have we? Block for birdie. Now, we'll tap that in to remain at plus one. Solid plan in the last five or six holes. Now on the tee at 16. Our guy. Michael Block. Important to put it in play on these last three holes. Trying to catch the down slope. Oh, that's great. Yeah. This is going to roll. And roll. <laughs> I had you, right? I, I, I had 1,100 RPM. <laughs> He'll have a good look to 16. Perfect angle for Block at 16. After a nearly 330-yard drive. Looks like he's on another good line. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Do it for him. A chance to get back to even par. Terrific approach of club professional Michael Block at 16. Routine birdie. Even par for the championship. On a very tough 17. This is his third shot. So obviously Michael missed the fairway off the tee. And enough spin to where that's going to be a tough. Here's the par putt for Michael Block. 22 feet up the hill. Turn. Look at this. Yeah. Fun conversation with Block. So he played 14. What a round of golf he's putting together. Yeah, put this tee shot right in the middle of the fairway on 18. Fantastic. Just one behind DeChambeau to the 18th. Block's just four back. Correct. In fact. <laughs> Shot. Settle down. Settle down. Chatted with Michael Block as well a little <laughs> bit earlier. And he's looking. Settle. To settle. Finish it one under. Well done. We'll give one last pop to the folks at O'Neill's <laughs> out of his golf course, Arroyo Tribuco. They are. So very proud of this 46 year old. And if you had a chance to listen to the conversation we had, hard not to pull for him. Club professional from Mission Viejo. Start of his second round. He was even par in the first round. He played great golf. Absolutely. Pipes it down the 10th, which will give him a chance to, for a birdie. What did he tell us? He loves it when they're firm and fast and he can just get that run. That was a good example of it. 
Michael Block from the fairway at 10. It was fun to listen to him yesterday talk about the fact that he had kind of one more little carrot he was looking for, and that was to be standing on the on the podium with the PGA champion and the grounds crew has to get out there and set the yep. holes for the second round. Michael Block, come on, birdie. get in there. Way to start. Wow, he's at one under par now. Red numbers for Michael Block. And what a hole this par three is. Played 248 yesterday. <laughs> that was it, but that was it, but yeah, it was quick. Headed left. Ooh. Best spot part you could be is in that bunker. Now Andy at the 11th. Yeah, this doesn't look very good. Awkward lie. At least he was in the sand. Yeah, that was it still has a chance to save par. Yep. To 11. Now Michael Block to save his par straight down the hill, a little right to left. How yes. He has got tons of confidence right now. Now on the tee at the 12th, coming off of a birdie and then a terrific up and down out of the bunker. Our club pro, Michael Block, and he splits the fairway right down the mower line at the 12th. Michael Block taking dead aim, you would think. And he just keeps it rolling. Look at this. No problem here, right, Bob? I would think we would call this one routine and just to show the wonderful randomness at 13. Yeah, shot. Thanks. Yeah, put this one in play like he did. We'll have wedge in hand. You know, for uh, you never know. These guys Might are not another. They're not used to laying up on par fives. It's not one of those huge hitters as a young guy. Now the birdie putt, Michael Block. Was two under through his first three holes, but on the par five, he pulled his birdie putt. Big, fast athletes hit the golf ball like we've never seen before. Michael Block, he's a big, strong dude. 317 yards today, where we fell in love with Michael Block yesterday. <laughs> Another good tee shot here. He just hits it, immediately turns around, hands the club to the caddy, and just keeps on rolling. <laughs> Won't see a lot of those today. And any of those players that are in that four or five over range, especially with the wind picking up this afternoon, we'll keep our eyes on that yeah. cut line. Pretty difficult shot here. Oh, That's got, well done. Doesn't need to worry right now about the cut line. He's worried about the top of the leaderboard. No, Michael Block at 14. Great chance to get to three under. Do it. And there it is. Rolls another one in. Three birdies in his first five holes. And Michael Block at the 131 yard par 315. Very accessible today, huh? Goose this one a little bit to the left. A lot of different oh levels of this green. Now Michael Block back at the par 315. He's got a putt down from one level to another right in here it goes back down and it'll gain speed beautifully judged oh what a putt at four five i'd be very confident i could get as high because the greens are going to dry out if, if it's blowing like that if you're in a four or five under and michael block 1990 bob boyd at shoal creek the last time a pga club professional had a top 20 at the PGA. Michael Block shot off the lead. And now about 30 feet for Michael Block to try to tie the lead at 16. Hold your line. Well, tap in par. Came right off the top of the club face. Didn't get a solid strike on it. Here's the par putt for Michael Block. Six playing tough, 17 as always playing so Dig. tough. Dig. Just not quite enough. That's okay, five. 
Out of position. That green obviously is elevated, but it is starched as the wind continues to pick up. Hope everyone enjoyed the first couple hours of this <laughs> hey there. second day. Michael Block on the tee at 18. Look at that ball go. You know, he's, when he was talking with you and, and Scott yesterday, he said, I love when you can use the run out. Middle of the fairway and a good long way down there. Yeah, only 154 yards, probably an eight iron. Get up there 10 or 12 feet short of the hole, just left of it. Come on, come off. Come on. Good shot. Very high quality shot there. Kind of get it started down the slope, cozy it up, see if it happens to fall in and get to the front. You can see Zayman expecting to go a little bit to his left. Just didn't do it. Andy made the point a few minutes ago. A lot of these downhill putts, the players are expecting them to be even quicker. They look really fast. Yes. Michael Block starts his second nine of the second round with a very good approach Thank shot you. at the first hole. Well, Michael Block and uh, Ken has joined Michael out on the first hole. Two wonderful shots into the perfect spot, a little bit down the hill. Do it. Michael Block. Little rescue trying to leave it short of the left traps. Get it a little too far left. Okay, take it. Saddle, saddle. Oh, he's fine. A club professional, one shot off the lead. See the number. Sit. Perfect. What a shot. Wow. Quit it. Big miss there. Michael Block can make this par putt. Yeah. He did. Put it up and down. What a <laughs> Block off the tee at four. Come on, wind. What if the wind helps this one and he gets a bounce? And he does. Yeah. And it did. All right. He could get close to the green with a second from there. All right, back to the fourth. And Ken Brown is watching about as compelling a story Ken, as we have in this championship. <laughs> Nonchalant. Just another good shot. I mean, the ball is like a, a yard off the club face, and he's just handing the club back to the caddy and moving on. Dave, you said it. He has been the story, not just of the morning, but maybe the story of the championship. Oh, and that's a miss. And you can ill afford. Yeah. There you go. Well done. Just settled right there, about seven feet for his par. Well, T shot finds the fairway for block. This straight back into the wind, and this looks healthy. Considering what happened on the last two poles, that is a tremendous shot. Over to six. And a chance for three for Block. It was a sensational long iron into this plateau, Frank. I didn't think anyone could get one up there into this breeze. With three holes to play, Daddy. Hybrid off the tee, and this is six iron well, downwind. Win. Cannot go at this whole location. Friendly bounce there. And Michael Block has the putt for birdie here, Mark. And a putt with not too much movements. Stress free. An ill wind is blowing across from the left. Can barely see the top of the flagstick. Tonight. And block. With an upslope and a All carry. How about this? Oh, that's some style points right there. Mm, I'll tell you what. And leaves it underneath the hole. You see that fist pump. I love it. Speaking of the merchandise, it is the um, PGA of the hoodie. <laughs> Seems like it, doesn't it? Yeah, Michael. Great job, Michael Block. 
in his fifth PGA Championship. Yes, we're on to the weekend, baby. 70 and 70. Like a magnet down that left side all week long. Hmm. Here's block at one. It's 231 back. Yeah, it must have clipped that tree off the tee. It's not too bad right there. Back at one. Here's the third shot for Michael Block. As he should at the end of the rose putt. So he knows what this is going to do. Just now, Michael Block, his second. The only Corbridge Financial PGA team member to make the cut. And boy, oh boy, hasn't he done it in style. And after that beautiful approach in here, Michael Block for birdie. Get it. Get it. What a bounce back after the bogey for Block. No draw, John. Cover it. No, it's not. Outside chance for a birdie. You might wonder how a 46-year-old club professional can be challenging some of the game's best, but give it a little snapshot. Michael Block has this for par. Trying to stay even on this round. Oh, yes! yes. That's clutch. It's no... Now it's uh, back again. To five. Get all the back there. Center of the green there for Michael Block, financial PGA team member, and will be winning that uh, the low club pro here this week. Oh my goodness, that's coming up well short. To seven. This is for par for Michael Block playing with Rose. Nice save. Good job. Now 10, Michael Block left off the tee, came up short, pitched to here. Oh, a big save. <laughs> you want to pick up the phone, get a left. Now Michael Block. So many today, probably half the field have taken iron here, lay up short of the bunkers. Got to get it in the fairway, though. And he's done it. That's ideal. Give himself a full. And he has. Yeah! It's blowing in and out of the left right now. Very difficult to find the right line. Just needs Stay a there, bounce. straight. Pretty close to that rough. Stop. Trying to play some sort of chasing shot. Really well done. <laughs> Seventeen now with Michael Block trying to hit a, a low fade with the three wood around the trees around the corner. I think that was the driver in. It's the easiest club to hit with a fade if you're going to go with driver, and he's done it well. <laughs> what a shot! How's the approaches he's hit on the last two holes? Forty-five feet for birdie for Michael. This to get to red figures. It's on the line. Fitting we have a club pro in the chase here when Walter Hagen, Rochester's very own, 
Got his start at the Country Club of Rochester, giving lessons, working in the shop. He's really the first true great professional golfer. Remember back in his day, being an amateur superseded that. Hagen went on to win this championship five times and giving lessons and being back in the shop. It's a noble profession to see, like we all have, the work that they do to teach, to learn, to greet, to meet, to understand, be compassionate, kind, represent their club, represent their community. And that's what he'll be doing next week. But in the meantime, he's on the ride of a lifetime. And he's going to have another late starting time tomorrow. Look up on that board and to see that your name is right there with all of these amazing players. Just below McElroy. Now on the tee from California, PGA professional Michael Block. That's the biggest ovation of the championship so far. It just downright overwhelming and people <laughs> cheering your every move. I don't know, I'm still here. Didn't clear that area. Welcome at the first tee for Michael Block. Let's hope he has one more spectacular round in him today. Draw spin. Spin. Well played. Very well played. Now can block it out of here with a par. Oh. A hybrid. Just kind of moves something about 240 yards or so down breeze. Good swing. Beautiful shot. Right up the heart. A top 15 finish today. We'll give him an invitation to next year's PGA Championship. Let's go to two. Like for the center of the green. Okay. Just find the speed early on the greens. Just get comfortable. Beautifully done. Courses like this where you can't blink to five. Yeah, exactly right. Tough course like this. This is a new hole, the fifth. Get Little boys in the snow. Right on line. And going with the hybrid. We saw this yesterday. Michael Block. Block After the unfortunate start, he's done pretty well. Just two over. Tracing by Tom Tracer there shows an excellent shot for the club pro. He can teach you how to hit that shot. He right, man. Does it spin? Strong. 14. Oh, this is not pretty. Michael Block, 60 yards up the hill at 14. Oh, he's done a good job there from that line. That yeah, is really tremendous. Good. Made, made birdie here yesterday after wow. talking with us, walking up Bunker Hill. 14 and six feet down the hill. Showing Rory the line as I suggested there when he came up so close. At the 15th. 
the fairy tale story. Gets better. He still doesn't believe it, but on the fly. Well, he ripped up the cup as he did it. But the roar of all roars in Rochester was just delivered by, of all people, Michael Block. down the right. Oh, it actually kicked. Great. Yeah. Dog legs to the right on 17 and 18. This is third shot. A little trouble from the tee for Michael Block. Yeah, it's a tough stretch. What a beautiful shot there. Tell you what, he, far. he is floating around Oak Hill Country. Block has this for par to remain at one over. Jim mentioned it earlier. Top 15 gets him back here next year. He needs a birdie at the last. So many of these shots to perfection. Tell you what, Jim, he showed up here at Oak Hill. Not many knew who he was, but he's leaving here as the crowd favorite. Might as well join him on 18. <laughs> And two to be in next year's field at Valhalla. That's perfect. Come on now, run it out. Look at Rory waving. Oh, that's actually Harry Diamond. What a shot. That is so good. 18. Here we are. Hopefully, just one stroke remaining. One five! Stay up. Get there. Yes! 
Magic. What a sport.